हेलो एवरी वन सो न्यू प्लेयर्स कीप ऑन आस्किंग मी इन माई क्लैन विच आर द न्यू बेस्ट गन्स आफ्टर द एम ओनर तो आई विल टेल यू माई टॉप फाइव प्राइमरी गन्स दैट आई आई कंसिडर आर वेरी गुड इन द न्यू पैच सो द नंबर वन गन आई वुड लाइक टू शो यू इज कूअर टोंकोर द रीज़न वाई दिस गन इज वेरी ओ पी राइट नाउ इज बिकॉज ऑफ द न्यू आर्केस दैट आर ड्रॉप्ड विथ वरुणा दैट इज आर्क एंड राइज दिस विल इंक्रीज सिक्सटी परसेंट चांस टू इंक्रीज वन फिफ्टी परसेंट डैमेज ऑन रीलोड एंड यू विल कंटिन्यूसली रीलोड ऑन दिस गन सो दिस आर्किन विल ऑलवेज बी ऑन यू विल गेटिंग वन फिफ्टी परसेंट डैमेज ऑन दिस गन दिस दिस आर्किन इज अ डायरेक्ट बफ टू दिस गन द डी यू मेड सो दिस गन इज ओ पी राइट नाउ दिस इज माई सेटअप दैट आई एम यूजिंग ऑल्सो वेरी गुड थिंग इज द रिवन डिस्पोजिशन इज थ्री यू कैन यूज अ वेरी गुड रिवेंस दैट आर इजिली अवेलेबल आई रिसेंटली बॉट दिस रिवन देन आई री रोल्ड इट फोर्टी एट टाइम्स एंड माई गन इज ओपी राइट ना अनदर थिंग आई एम यूजिंग इन विद दिस बिल्ड इज विजिलिटी सप्लाईज इन द प्लेस ऑफ कॉशियस शॉट बिकॉज आई गॉट प्राइम श्योर फुटेड इफ यू डोंट हैव दिस जस्ट पुट कॉशियस शॉट हियर एंड दिस इज वर्क सिमिलर ऑल्सो इन प्लेस ऑफ दिस रिवन यू कैन यूज हैमर शॉट एंड द गन स्टिल विल बी ओपी Let's see how Tonkor works in Steel Path. Good to see you, Stalker. Come and die. Die for the people watching. So with this gun, you can make a complete joke out of stalker, even in steel path. I'm one shotting them very easily without room removing their arm. So my second best primary AOE gun is a Tomb Finger. Uh, this is what I'm using a very heavy form of weapon. Uh, this gun also have dispo disposition of three, so you will get very good stats on the ribbon. Also, the ribbons are easily available for uh, get guns. So, my ribbon is almost got there. Also, this gun has infinite uh, ammo because of battery recharge, packs charge, uh, and this this works very well. The ammo recha recharge is instant. Uh, this gun is very good. Let me show you how it works. So let me show you the tomb finger steel path mod stage hold on i'm sending auxiliary life support i'm using this because i'm not using uh any fire it mod on this weapon so i'm using this They just vanish. The 
juicy red crits. So to make the tomb finger that I'm using, you need a tomb finger chamber, a tremor grip, and a splat loader. And a lot of crit mods. Uh, kit gun ribbons are very easy to get. They are very cheap on the market. You can get them for two to three platinums. Just roll them. Uh, you will definitely get a good ribbon very easily. Um, so the third gun is Fanmore. Everyone knows about Fanmore. This patch, uh, this gun is very OP. This patch uh, because of the fifth skill that uh, evolution five that you will get 50% chance to deal 2000 damage on non-critical hits. Uh, also, the thing that makes this weapon good is you only need two forma for just uh, making this weapon very good. Uh, the thing that I don't like about this weapon is uh, you need to charge the incarnate mode and this weapon is not AoE which uh, removes the fun part from this game in my opinion. A lot of people enjoy this weapon and this weapon is very good, very damaging weapon. Uh, the evolutions I'm using is first is uh, in Ghanan form, second I'm using accuracy, less recoil because the rest that you get are not that good. Uh, third is on head headshot kill 20% chance to instant reload. Uh, the rest two are also subjective and not that good. Uh, this is good uh, in my opinion so i took this one uh, in evolution 4 you can also pick uh, the 50 percent more chance to increase in gun and meter thing uh, that one is also good uh, I'm, I'm thinking just right now to equip that uh, doesn't matter this mod is also this uh, evolution is also good because uh, the negative uh, crit chance uh, it will increase the chances of getting 2000% damage that you get at evolution 5 uh, which is the main part of this weapon so let's move how this gun works so we are in steel path let's see how fenmore works let's first charge then car and phone you can see the meter below it will charge get kills bad part part about this weapon is you need to charge it to make it open uh, and I am dead dead while charging this weapon wow now that a charge in current form this would become a machine gun good weapon not that good decent I'm not covering ferrex latum which works similar way all are available uh, with the similar feature and are all are good you, know, you will get these weapons in Angels of Zerman quest All weapons are available there Next move Let's move to next gun So the last gun I would like to show you Is Tenet Archaplasmor This gun has ridiculous amount of damage in it using only one uh, prime mod here you can use two of them and but two will uh, interfere the elements that I'm using here three elements with galvanized savvy and I will get millions of damage this when this weapon is also decent uh, but you will get a lot of damage with it. Let's go to steel path and see how these weapons work. Shut 
so this is how it does in steel path it's quite good it needs a little bit of time for charging the merciless and this will annihilate everything in its part good weapon I love to use this weapon on index just use magnetic and everything will die there we are getting 3 million damage 6 million 3 million Before ending this video, I would like to share some thoughts with the new Tenos. See this game is all about fun. Don't run after the OP weapons. Uh, try using all of the weapons. Sometimes what happens is you will find some weapons that are not even good but are very fun to use. Uh, I myself likes very much to use Artinox. This weapon is very trash but I love to use it so I kept it I'm modding it uh, also the Estella Prime is not that great that but I enjoy playing with it uh, it depends upon you and and it doesn't uh, make the rest of the weapons not that much bad uh, every weapon is good in this game you just need to mod it correctly and enjoy the game uh, another thing is not everything is all about damage uh, some weapons even works great uh, you just need to remove armor D introduces earlier patches that increased headshot damage and uh, many abilities like Necros, uh, second ability, Thanos, Strike of uh, Steinex, uh, Ash Shuriken. These abilities will completely remove the armor and even less damaging guns like Exeltra will do just fine uh, because you have removed the armor. A little bit of Slash will kill even 100 level enemies very easily uh, uh, a lot of guns I would like to show but uh, they are all already many videos available in YouTube also the Warframe uh, sites display these weapons like Natarok Natarok is good but not uh, uh, that fun to use Bobonico is good Sido uh, is good Exeltra is good uh, I like to use Shadow also Shadow is very good uh, Synapse Synapse is very underrated gun this is very good uh, almost as good as uh, the pistol that Nucor Kuva Nucor and this gun has similar damage But uh, these guns like Kuva Zar that uh, many players will still recommend are not that. Uh, they are completely killed because of their ammo. Damage is still good. But you will get so less ammo. Even you are using ammo drum mod, you are getting so less ammo that these guns are totally dead. Uh, the, there are many ways to still use this weapon like uh, using abilities ammo 75% uh, uh, that ability what it's called uh, energizing munitions uh, uh, tenet envoy I don't like this a very slow weapon uh, but this weapon is also good uh, so 
that's all for this video uh thank you for watching